I'm Katie Ullman reporting for Katie Chats at the Telefilm Canada Burke's Red Carpet at TIFF 2014. I'm here with Michaela Cochran and Kyle Thomas. What has been the most exciting part of TIFF for you guys so far? Ooh, the most exciting part. Um, well, we actually got to go to a uh, musical event at Festival Music House the other night, and I'm a really huge fan of Tribe Called Red, and I got to see them, so that was really cool. I don't know if that's the most exciting, but that's the first thing that came to mind. <laughs> Uh, well, I think the most exciting thing for me was opening night and having having everyone there. Um, we had seven out of the eight uh, uh, pr uh, principal cast there for opening night and just to gauge that reaction, do the Q&A after and, and really get a sense of how the movie hit people. Uh, this, th that's why I'm here and it's, there's nothing better than that. Did you get the audience reaction that you expected to? Were people laughing or responding in the right places? Yeah, I think that and more. I think it was it was actually more than I thought. It was stronger than I thought because the you know the film is told in four parts and people may relate to different parts uh, depending on kind of what's happened in their own lives, right? They may relate to it differently, and and I think that I was just shocked at how many people were really moved by the project. So I think we've done our job. That's really good. <laughs> And the other actors were raving about working with Kyle and having a lot of freedom on set in terms of improv and the process. Can you tell me a little bit about what it was like for you? No pressure, like he's standing right here. <laughs> um, yeah, Kyle that. was an incredible director. Uh, we did we did have tons of freedom about with the improv and stuff, but as well as that, there was uh, Kyle was constantly checking in to make sure we were comfortable because a, a lot of the subject matter is pretty heavy, and there's always possibility for personal relation to that as like a human being besides being an actor. So it was like Kyle was always checking in, making sure that we felt safe with it, and like if we felt that we were handling it in a like respectful way, and that definitely opened up for what felt like a safer environment to be performing in. And where's the best place for us to find out more information on the Valley Below online? You can uh, go to thevalleybelow.ca or find us uh, on Twitter at NC Cinema or on Facebook, The Valley Below Movie. Thanks so much, and it was great seeing you both again. Thanks a lot. Thank you. Yeah.